also referred to as an airbag cushion, is a type of safety device that you can expect to find in almost every car these days. It is a flexible fabric bag that is designed to inflate in a fraction of a second in the case of any situation when the vehicle comes to an abrupt halt, such as during an accident. Well, the process all happens extremely quickly, which is the whole point. An airbag deploys in the blink of an eye, or even faster. Take a look at the deployment of an airbag in slow motion, filmed at 2,500 frames per second. On average, the entire process of deployment of an airbag completes in 0.120 seconds, depending on the vehicle. And the a large amount of harmless gas instantly fills the nylon bag installed behind the steering wheel as the explosive burns. At that point, the plastic cover is torn off the steering wheel and the bag inflates, much like a balloon, and lo and behold! A protective pillow for your face, a large amount of harmless gas instantly fills the nylon bag installed behind the steering wheel as the explosive. The bag itself is made of a thin, nylon fabric which is folded into the steering wheel or dashboard or, more recently, the seat or door. The sensor is the device that tells the bag to inflate. Inflation happens when there is a collision force equal to running into a brick wall at 10 to 15 miles per hour, 16 to 24 kilometers per hour. The airbag's inflation system reacts sodium azide, NAN3, with potassium nitrate, KNO3, to produce nitrogen gas. Hot blasts of the nitrogen inflate the airbag. The airbag's inflation system reacts sodium azide, NAN3, with potassium nitrate, KNO3, to produce nitrogen gas. Hot blasts of the nitrogen inflate. Disregarding seat belts and relying entirely on the airbag could be a very risky undertaking. In fact, in some cars, an airbag won't even be fully functional if some energy of the forward thrown occupant is not absorbed by the seat belt. Remember, an airbag only supplements the effectiveness of your seat belt. To put it plainly, it's really a good idea to wear your seat. Seat belt are compulsory for everyone even for back seaters because they are traveling in the same car. They are traveling on the same speed. If there is collision they will also get hurt. Seat belt are compulsory for everyone even for back seaters because they are traveling in the same car. They are traveling on the same speed. If there is collision they will also get hurt. Seat belt are compulsory for everyone even for back seaters because they are traveling in the same car. They are traveling on the